game, and welcome to Devil May Cry 2. Thank you so much for joining me here today. We are jumping into, we finished Devil May Cry 1 up here, and now we're jumping into Devil May Cry 2, and I had it on this screen because when you click on it, as you can see, it gives you an option between two different uh, characters to choose from, our boy Dante or Lucia, 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 I think it's Lucia. So that leads me to believe that we may have two different campaigns. So we're going to start with Dante, and then after I finish Dante playthrough, I'll do a playthrough with Lucia and see if it uh, if her campaign is any different from Dante's. And if so, I'll play do a full playthrough with her as well. But for now, we're going to jump in as Dante. So you guys sit back, relax, enjoy the video, and we're diving into Devil May Cry 2. Let's do this. I'd like to continue even though I'm starting an old game. And we are gonna go new game. Alright, here we go. In a time long since past. In an age of darkness, when the earth was overrun with demons, and humans were powerless under their rule. Humanity's hope lived in a demon named Sparta. With a spirit unlike any other, and wielding the sword that bore his own name, Sparta eradicated the demons. That's gonna make combat 
so much fun. Bam, yes. Oh, that's badass. Alright, I gotta get used to circle. Circle to, to, to roll. Oh, oh, I need... You'll go different directions when you press R1. Oh, and he already does the sword dash. That's so cool. Alright, I'm gonna quit gushing over the game. And I'm gonna get this herb. Herb. Orb. God, I keep doing that because of Resident Evil. Calling the orbs herbs. Can I jump over this? Yes, I can. What's going on over here? Oh. Hello. Hey, let me up. Feeling like I can get up there and do something. Oh, 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 la la, green orb. 
absorb a crystal with condensed demon fluid, it will instantly recover your vitality. Okay, so green for health, white for magic, red is obviously going to be for upgrades. So that's going to be a little weird. It's a circle to it's a circle to dodge and circle to check doors. So and it's also circle to wall run. So if a door doesn't work, you're going to be doing a lot of that, I suppose. The setting is interesting. Hoping we get some backstory on where the hell we are right now. Because this is like way different from the first game of all baddies. I don't know if I can change who I'm locked on. I do like that it's giving me a health meter for the bad guys at the bottom of the screen. So I can see where I'm at with that. That's interesting. Ugh, the way he's moving on this game is pretty cool. Can I bust these guys up? Uh oh. My boy Dante got a little stuck there for a minute. That was weird. Cool. I can bust those and get orbs. That's nice. What about the bench? Nope. That's a sturdy bench, or maybe I'm just drunk and I keep missing it. There we go. Dante, you drunkard. I got, I got it. Oh, yellow orb, I want it, I want it. Give me that yellow orb, baby. Crystal generated by immortals with the power of resurrection. Good. Oh, it's a gold orb this time. Shield at me like a boomerang. Is that everybody? No. Still not it. Yeah. <laughs> 
missed. I was trying to be badass and I missed. Bye. Bye.